Hi everyone. It's Kim from Affordably Crafty and today I have some Happy Mail. So some of the stuff I've had sitting on the side of me for a little bit. Mm, try again. Hi everyone. It's Kim from Affordably Crafty and today I have some Happy Mail and something that I ordered and received from a fellow yarn tuber, um, which I am super happy to open and check out. If you're new here, welcome. My channel is all about learning how to stretch your craft dollar and be affordably crafty. Please like, share, and subscribe. Um, so yes, I'm very excited about a few of these. So I kind of know what's in this one. So I'm going to I'm going to open this one first. So this one is from Sherry K. Loves yarn. And I will put links in the description box for all these folks. Um, oops. Stay. Now Sherry K. and I went on a, a yarn road trip. A yarny road trip to uh, Western Mass. I will link the videos for that down in the description box. Super tons of fun. And while there, obviously, we got to lots of talking and hanging out. And I had mentioned what one of my, um, oh, she gave me a card. One of my um, thrifting unicorns is. And Sherry was so kind to share one with me because she has two. Let's see. So it's a pretty brown card. And it says, doo -doo -doo. Hi, Kim. Thank you so much for meeting up with me. I had a blast. <laughs> Enjoy. Love and hugs, Sherry. Okay. Woohoo! I'm super excited about this. So, for those of you who don't know, um, one of the bigger crochet YouTubers is Crystal from Bag a Day. And she has a very particular hook that she likes to use that is very hard to find because it is vintage and she has a very particular hook size that she likes to use and that is the hero hook in size j which has been one of my thrifting unicorns but looky here what sherry gave me hero hook size j oh I cannot wait to work up my first bag a day pattern with this hook. Ugh, made in Germany. I found some hero hooks, but they've been tiny little tatting hooks, and I want the full bag a day J hook hero experiment or experience, shall we say? Um, so I can't wait to give this a try and see what she loves so much about these hero hooks. Oof. I will be doing a review on this hook coming soon on my channel. Thank you so much, Sherry. I had tons of fun. Let's do it again soon. <laughs> well, once I save up some more money. <laughs> um, then this has been sitting in my to film pile for a little while. I'm very sorry. <laughs> um, this is from Granny D. And this actually was in response to my sharing of um darn good yarn deals with her affiliate link so let's see what we have in here let's see hmm. oh that's so cute look at that is a squirrel love you king thanks for all your help d oh that's awesome that's gotta go up here somewhere what's it there hmm. it'll fit there for right now maybe Oops. yes that little fit there for right now. Oh, thanks, Dee, for the cool card. Okay. Let's see what kind of treasures we have here. Let's see. Ooh. So there is a... <laughs> oh, that's funny, Dee. Oh, my goodness. That's amazing. Holy monkeys. So Dee had said, I'd like to do something for you because of all your help with the darn good yarn sales. 
and I said, you know, I'd love something knitted from you because I don't knit. Now, this is the only other knitted item that I own previously. This is from Gary from Urban Yarn, and this is his Bush Tracker beanie pattern, which he just released this week. So I know people have been asking about where this pattern is. So I will link down below. It's knit. I'll link down below the, the link to the video where Gary explains all the ins and outs of this pattern. Um, so yeah, this has been released. So I'm super happy for Gary. Um, oh, that's really cute. Okay. So first, I have a hat. I'm super excited. Let's see how it fits. Ooh, that is comfy. Oh, dear, it feels really good. This feels like it's made with wool. Oh, a nice gray texture. A gray yarn, I gray wool yarn, I think. Is it wool? What do you guys think? Let me fix my hair. It's a little, a little, a little all over the place. What do you think? Thank you, Dee. I love my hat. Thank you so much. And then, oh my goodness, she made me a cow. That's awesome. <laughs> oh, this is really soft. Mm. She made me a black cow. Um, I didn't expect this many things. Thank you so much, Dee. I really appreciate it. Let's try this on. Let me fix my hair. Oh my goodness, this is so comfortable. Oh, thank you, Granny D. This is great. And I don't have a black cow, so this will match lots of things. Especially when I forget my face mask. <laughs> and then there's one more thing. Oh, this is pretty cool. She wrote an awesome note. <laughs> so she wrote, Sorry about the section of pink, but I didn't know I'd be gifting it to you at the time I made it. Maybe you can wrap it so it doesn't show. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, I do not like pink. Oh, this is cool. That's awesome. Check this out. So it's a very colorful scarf. It's got like a lime green, a tangerine, a dark teal, lavender, a raspberry, purple, a yellow, a pink, a blue, a yellow, a brown, and an olive. This is really cool. Let's see, nice and long. Oh, uh, rappy rappy woo woo. How's that? It's like the scarf of many colors. I love it. <laughs> Thank you so much, Dave. I really, really appreciate it. And I'm happy that I could help to support you a little bit with the darn good yarn sales that I was um, letting everybody know about. And then the last thing I have here is from Brenda, the newbie crocheter. Um, something that I had seen on a live and I wanted to jump right on. move this over here um and i ordered one and honestly the turnaround time on this was super quick oh oops maybe i don't need scissors for this oh, 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 oh. i was surprised how quick it was i haven't even looked at this yet so i'm super excited oops what was that oh that was a card okay and tape Tape, tape, tape. Mm, excited. Hey, so uh, this is going to work out really nicely on our live on Saturday, um, where we're going to talk about Unaffordably Geeky. Uh, let's see. We're going to be talking about crochet tools and our hooks, those other things we use in crocheting. Let me see about this card. Ooh, that's 
cool. Oh, I don't want to lose anything. Well, look, it's a thanks card. Kim, thank you so much for your purchase. I hope you enjoy it, including our pegs of different sizes for more uses. Thank you again. God bless Brenda the Newbie Crocheter. Wow, this is really nice. Well, that's cool. She attached her card onto it. She got a nice card. All about crochet, yarns, hooks, polymer clay, and more. Hmm. And she gave me a sticker. No problem. Sorry. No problema. <laughs> that's cute. Okay. So this is beautiful. I believe if I remember correctly, her husband made this. Wow, this is awesome. So I have my very first blocking board. Look at how beautiful this is. Is this not beautiful? Tape measure. I don't have a tape measure handy. Um, I don't have a tape measure handy. Sorry, guys. Oh, my God. This is so beautiful. So, oh, I just loud. I'm sorry. Um, she had sent me pictures, three pictures of different color um, stains that had been made, and I was able to pick the one that I wanted. I wanted the darkest one. Um, this is just beautiful. So it comes with, it's really thick too, and it kind of has little feet on the back, so it doesn't scratch anything. It comes with the little pegs that go into it. So you can block onto it. I have not, <laughs> confession time, ever blocked any of my work. <laughs> I know that's crazy, right? But I haven't. Just haven't. So you put the pegs in and then you block your work. And there is, those are the tallest ones. Then there's some medium size and some smalls. I gotta get a bigger zippy bag so these fit in it. But, oh my God, this is so beautiful and so well made. And I believe this cost me $30 which is crazy. I will link Brenda's channel down below. And again, thank you so much, Brenda. This is beautiful, wonderful work. I will be showing this on Saturday on my live or our live on Affordably Geeky where we talk about crochet tools that aren't hooks. So that about wraps up my happy mail and acquisition from a fellow yarn tuber. Um, let me know if anybody's ever got anything from Brenda before. Brenda the Newbie Crochet. And thank you so much, Dee, for this beautifulness. And thanks for joining me. <clears throat> Please like, share, and subscribe so your friends can be affordably crafty too. Have a creative day, everyone. Bye.